and welcome. In the previous lecture, we have studied about the active and passive voice, and you have learned from the different teachers that about the active and passive voice as you get in your online recorded lectures. Well, guys, in this lecture, we are going to do the practice of active and passive voice. Well, what is active and passive voice? As I have told you before, that subject with verb and object. This is the active sentence, and when we are changing the sentence into passive, our subject becomes object, and object becomes subject. I have the object over here, which is the subject now in the sentence. Then we have helping verb with the third form of verb. Use preposition by, and the last is subject. Which becomes object over here. I just want to write down S over here for the subject so it would be clear to you guys. Subject becomes object and object becomes subject. Now, over here we are going to study about that which is the correct helping verb we are using over here. So, guys, we are using over here present simple. Present simple we use is, am, or are. We do not use do and does for the helping verbs in any passive. So, the floor dash clean by him. So, you have to tell the answer. I will tell the answers in the video, but you have to guess first. Second, we have past simple. The helping verbs of past simple are was and were. The situation is same over here. Subject, verb and object. Subject becomes Object and object became subject. Now the floor is became subject over here. You have to write down the helping of over here that the floor was cleaned or floor were clean. I have used the same verb over here to make it clear that we are not going to change the meaning of the sentence. We are going to change the tense of the sentence. So we have to change the helping verbs over here. So see, they clean the floor. After that, the floor dash clean by them. You have to write down which helping verb is correct or suitable for this tense. The third one is she will clean the floor. The same verb I have used over here. And you have to use the correct helping verb over here. Will be. So guys, in these three tenses, the first one I want to tell you that we always use be. With the will. Because we always use base form of verb with the will, we do not use second, third or fourth form. For example, I want to tell you, for the future, simple. We use will with the first form of verb. In the future continuous, we use will with the fourth form. But before the fourth form, we have to use be. Third, will with the third form in future perfect but we always use third form and between these two we have to use have which is the base form and in the future perfect continuous will have been so as you can see that with the will we do not use second third or fourth form we have to use the base form of verb and we are using be over here as a base form so ready first one is he cleans the floor the floor dash cleaned by him. I knew that. You people have guessed correct. The clean floor is cleaned by him. Second, they clean the floor. It is the past simple. The floor was cleaned by them. And the last one is very easy. Floor will be cleaned by them. So guys, what you have to do? Make the sentences practice more and more so that the more you practice, the more you learn. So guys, do the practice and you will be easily learn the correct use of helping verb and the main verb in the passive sentences. Thank you very much.